Hi everyone, Chad here on the Nomadic Scooter Channel. Thanks for watching this episode. I've bought from Mini Motors a Dualtron X Limited that I'm gonna get unboxed on this episode. I'm in Custer State Park up by Rapid City, South Dakota. If you haven't already, hit like and hit subscribe. Right now though, I'm gonna get the scooter unboxed and then take it for a ride. All right, yeah, so I picked this up from Mini Motors uh, and they shipped this out to me. Like I say, I'm in uh, Custer State Park, South Dakota. I'm leaving Rapid City and uh, heading south because uh, this morning it was about 16 degrees and <laughs> it's only about 32 right now. Uh, today's what, like uh, November 18th or the 19th, so pretty chilly. Uh, that's why I'm wearing all this heavy gear. So we'll get this out and see how this thing's packaged in here. I might have to speed this video up. Scooter out of here. All right. It's in like a like a crate. Well, wow, that's really nice. Hey, right. if you take a look at this uh, suspension on here, fully adjustable motorcycle uh, rebound, and you can adjust the compression. Look at the size of the spring on this shock on the back, and the front one is the same. Uh, so this thing is is uh, fully adjustable. Can't wait to get out and ride it and uh, and really try this uh, try this setup out. All right, so this is just looking like uh, 10 millimeters. I just got a socket on my drill and uh... gonna go around and uncrate this uh... Dualtron X limit. See, it's already coming apart that easily. Just bend them over <laughs> like that. <laughs> Boom. All right, I think that's it to get the top off. There, just like that. <laughs> I'll get the uh, scooter finished ready, getting it uncrated, and uh, get it set up. The scooter itself, though, seems to be all complete. It don't look like there's any assembly. The handlebars all on here, uh, shocks, everything. So just probably doing a pre-trip on it and checking the. Uh, axle nuts and uh, just going over it, making sure things on it are tight, and uh, be ready to take it for a ride. I don't know what the charge is on it, but we'll find that all out uh, as soon as I finish getting this uncrated and set up. All right, I was finally able to get this Dualtron X Limited unboxed and uncrated. Some of the stuff they included in the box, they were in some of the smaller boxes that were kind of stacked on top. They included a steering dampener, a small charger, that charges the battery that's in the stem to run all the lights. And then they included this big Mini Motors uh, lithium ion fast charger. This one says six amps. So this is kind of stuff that was in the box. Uh, we'll do a go around the camp with uh, go around the scooter with the camera and uh, check out some of the features on it and some of the lights. I just unboxed it. I don't even know any of the features or anything on this scooter until I ride it for a few days and uh, take it on a couple trips. But we'll kind of, I'll just kind of go around the scooter and we'll kind of just check it out a little bit. And then uh, I'll put the GoPro on and take it for a ride and kind of see how it, uh, how it rides. So, right, and like I say, one of the reasons I picked up this uh, Dualtron X Limited was because of this motorcycle-like suspension. So it's a fully adjustable coil over shocks. Uh, and you can see there a rebound uh, on, the, on the shock adjuster. Uh, really, really nice looking scooter. As we come around the scooter, uh, you can see uh, it, these light up on the side. These look like the heat sinks to the uh, motor controllers in the back. Again, look at this front shock in here. That, uh, um, like I say, fully adjustable. This coil over, you can, you know, make it uh, kind of do whatever you need it to do. And uh, uh, let's go around to the handlebars and. Uh, as, as you can also see, it turns on the uh, the lights for the Dualtron. So, and it's got lights on the side and and a really nice scooter. After some much tinkering around with the uh, with the Dualtron X Limited, uh, I had to download uh, Mini Motors app on my phone, and I had to put in a code to unlock the scooter, the safe mode and uh, get it all set up. But I've got the scooter all set up. It's not fully charged. It's only about 
25% right now, but let me tell you, it, it rips, it's fast. So uh, right now I've got the GoPro on and uh, I'm gonna take it, uh, we'll take it out on a wildlife loop road at uh, Custer State Park. So we'll take it down this dirt road and then uh, take it around the, uh, take it down the wildlife road here. If you haven't already, hit like and hit subscribe. Thanks everyone for watching. Right now, let's take this Dualtron X Limited out on the road and take it for a ride. Him. All right, so. I am starting off in, uh, in Power One. And it, uh, in the app now, you can adjust like how much power the scooter starts off with. So it doesn't start off real abruptly and spin the tires. You can set so that it, uh, uh, you know, takes off gradually, but I, I took all that off, so it's pretty much just raw power. First gear is about 11 miles an hour. This is a really nice gear if you're cruising in a city. Um, I know in LA you're not supposed to go over 25 miles an hour on a scooter, so I mean, this is perfect for that. Uh, let's see, let's, let's kick it up another, let's try second gear. Wow! Okay, well, second gear. All right, well, second gear is about 25 miles an hour. All right, we are flying in second gear. Test the brakes. Oh, it's got good uh, good back pressure on the brakes, the uh, regenerative braking. And I'll show you just how much power in second gear. So it'll spin them right out, and I'm, I'm only at about, uh, like I say, 20% battery, and uh, Got a couple cars out here. We're gonna take it on this uh, wildlife loop road. Um, all these damn cars came out of nowhere. Okay. Wow, this thing's got some power. Whoa! Oh man, this is a nice scooter. Gotta, I'm fogging up in here. Okay. Well, this is just second gear. And I think this is in dual motor all the time, so. Oh, see, second gear is nice. 26 miles an hour. And, uh, you know, just cruising. It's been snowing up here, so you can see the all the loose stone and dirt in the road, and the dirt roads are kind of crappy, so. Try not to uh, wipe out on this loose rock and stuff in the road, but oh yeah, this is nice. Oh yeah, I like that. Second gear, what a perfect cruising gear. Oh yeah. We're coming up on a hill now. I mean, this is all big hill and it's oh, just going right up. We got a lot of power. Oh, this is really nice. All right, well, let's, uh, let's flip a U-turn. I'm gonna check, make sure no one's behind me. Wow, uh, I really gotta go in the app and adjust the, uh, this is second gear I'm in. Um, how much torque, you can also adjust the torque on the motors from like weak, normal to strong, uh, how much torque. The, uh, how much torque the scooter puts out, so. All oh, the regenerative braking is nice and strong. Oh yeah, it's nice. We're going downhill now. I'm just going back down the hill I was just on. And, uh, I put it into third gear. Okay, let's see where we're at now. Okay, third gear. 40 miles an hour. Wow, that's a little fast for me on a scooter. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. Well, like I say, there's a lot of loose stone, but okay, we'll get it going here. Okay. All right. Third gear is uh, just over 40 miles an hour. Here we go. Okay. All right, here we are. 40 miles an hour. All right. That, uh, It's fast. It's going. All right. 41. 41 miles an hour. Third, uh, that's third gear. No, 
really strong regenerative braking. All right. Okay. I'm gonna check, make sure nobody's behind me. And uh, do a little U-turn here. Okay, fourth gear. <laughs> here we go, fourth gear. Forty, one, two, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-nine, fifty miles an hour, uphill. Okay, that's uh, fourth gear. Okay, now it's going to fifth. And like I said, my battery is not topped up. I'm only at about 25%, so that's why I'm not really riding it even very far. Oh yeah, she rides through 50, 51. Okay, oh, it's very strong regenerative braking. Okay. This is Wild Loof, Wildlife uh, Loop Road on the uh, first gear is plenty. See how it is off road. Oh yeah, it's got that little suspension in it. Soaks all this right up. Oh, that rock. Okay. All right, let's try and get out of here now. A lot of power climbing these hills right up out of here. I'm in first gear, so. Okay. All right. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's uh, go into second gear. Well, like I say, I'm headed south. Uh, it's uh, about 32 degrees out right now in uh, Rapid City, South Dakota. It's November 19th. And uh, I'm going to load up the scooter and uh, go do some riding uh, in a warmer place than this because it was like 13 degrees this morning. And uh, this is where I'm at right now. It's called the... Uh, French Creek Natural Area. All right, so yeah, this is the, uh, I'll stand back. This is the, the Dualtron X Limited. Look at the size of the deck on that scooter. Oh yeah. So. Joining me on this episode, uh, right in the uh, Dualtron X Limited. Like I say, I'm headed to uh, some warmer places than this. It's absolutely freezing out here. Out at uh, Custer State Park in Rapid City, South Dakota. It's about 35 degrees or so right now. And that's the high today, and it was uh, about 13 this morning. So I'm at the French Creek Natural Area, just off Wildlife Loop Road. And uh, I'm gonna load the scooter up. And go ride some more places headed south though i can tell you that much some place where it's a lot warmer than uh than it is here i have such a blast riding these uh i like being able to share this with you and uh you know i have such a blast riding these electric scooters i've always ridden motorcycles dual sport off-road stuff uh super bikes so to see what uh, companies like Mini Motors and Voro Motors and uh, the other manufacturers to see, you know, what they've built and what is out on the market and and really the industry and community around these electric scooters. This thing is an absolute rocket ship. I can't wait to get it uh, charged up 
and uh, take it on some different rides. So if you haven't already hit like and hit subscribe, like I say, I bought this from Mini Motors and uh, I'm gonna have it out on a lot more rides. So uh, uh, the scooter's not going anywhere. And uh, like I say, headed south where it's warmer. So uh, I'll see you on the next episode. Uh, thanks for checking me out.